Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. Today I'm bringing you a drugstore alcohol. I also have a couple things from Target we're going to go through, but um, yeah, it's mostly a bunch of drugstore makeup. So let's not waste any time and dive in. Before we do, really quick, I do want to tell you guys I am doing a giveaway currently. Uh, I will link the giveaway video down below. Check out there so you know how to subscribe. No, I think you know how to subscribe. So you know how to enter and win and all that stuff. So. Let's dive into the video. Hopefully I'm going to film this pretty quickly. My camera battery is going to die soon. I hope I can get through it. I've been pre-filming a lot today. So, yeah. Okay. First thing is from Target and these. I just picked up a backup of my favorite um, makeup remover wipes. These are the Simple Cleansing Facial Wipes. Absolutely love these. Next thing I got was a new makeup bag. This one is from Sonia Kashuk. I do have a big, big Sonia Kashuk bag that I absolutely love. But... Once I put, like, all my hair products, my deodorant, my perfumes, my toothbrush, my toothpaste, and all that stuff, and makeup, like, that bag is, like, exploding. So I wanted to get a separate bag for my makeup and then just have that bag for, like, hair and skincare products and things like that. So, again, this one's from Sony Kashuk. Super, super cute with the little, little lippy sticks on it. it. has one zipper. You open it up. This side you have one. Um, clear compartment for makeup. You have a divider and the divider is um, for your brushes which I think is really cool. Sorry it's kind of dirty. I used it this weekend. Um, and then the other side here is another compartment for all your makeup. Super cute. Um, I absolutely love this. I think this will be perfect for what I want it for. So really excited to have that. Okay so diving into things from Ulta. I got a bunch of color correctors because you guys know that I am doing a, a Battle of the Drugstore series on my channel in the next um, one is going to be Battle of the Drugstore Color Correctors. So we'll start with those. The first one I picked up is from Wet n Wild. Actually, this is from Walgreens. This is the only thing I got from Walgreens. I did not get this from Ulta. But um, this is just from Wet n Wild. It has the green, the purple, the white, and the yellow. So I picked him up. This was really exciting. I'm really excited to try this. This is... Um, and NYX HD finishing powder, but it's a color corrector. It's green, so I'm really excited to see how the powders compare to the creams. So I picked that up. I also picked up the NYX HD concealer, but this is in their green shade. I have like the normal concealer in the normal concealer shade, but I wanted to try the uh, color corrector out. Yeah, this one from Physicians Formula. I already took it out of the packaging, but it did say new on the packaging. This one intrigued me so much. So this is a cushion. It looks exactly like their cushion foundation packaging, except for different colors, but it has, like, the cushion on top here. Super, super cute. Push the button, open it up. It has a little sponge here and a mirror. And then your color corrector is a cushion, and there's two in there. I wish they put some sort of divider in the middle to kind of help separate them, but I'm really, really excited to try this. I think this is such an interesting idea, so um, super excited to try that. Um, next couple ones I got look almost exactly the same. This one is from Ulta. This one is from Revlon. The Revlon, no, this is from L'Oreal. Sorry, this is the L'Oreal Infallible Total Cover. Um, I believe this L'Oreal one is new. You get four shades in here, and then you get this, like, weird little sponge thing, which I probably will never use and lose here pretty shortly. But the purple, green, the yellow, and the concealer shade there, so excited to try that guy. Then I got one from Ulta, which almost looks identical to the Revlon one. Packaging is a little bit different, and with the Ulta one, you do get a brush, which I appreciate. Has a little place for it right in there, and you get the yellow, the green, the purple, the concealer, and then you get like a medium brown shade, which I'm curious to see if that'll be good for contouring maybe so definitely excited to try that one out so I got a bunch of lippies because I'm planning on doing um, some lip swatch and review videos soon picked up four of the new L'Oreal infallible paints um, I'm really excited to see how I like these formula I did wear one already I wore this one this one is in the shade 310 topless um, and I'm not, I'm not really sure yet. I don't know. I don't want to say too much, but I am going to be doing a review on these soon. I want to try them out a little bit more. 
but um, I do have some things to say already, so um, I'm excited to film that video. I also picked up a bunch of NYX Liquid Suede Lippies, because again, I want to do a lip swatch and review on these. I already have quite a few of these, but I wanted to pick up some more colors to add to that video. On my lips right now, I am wearing this one, which is in the shade Vintage. Absolutely beautiful. I love it. I'm really excited for this like coral color, too. I think it's going to be beautiful in the summer. But stay tuned for that video, because I'm going to lip swatch and review all these guys for you. Next couple things I picked up were just some lashes. I got the Ardell 110s, which are just my favorite like natural, really pretty lash. I also picked up the Ardell... 600 black wispies they look like that a little more dramatic than I would normally wear but I wanted to try something a little bit different so I picked those up we'll see how they look uh, next couple things I got were from the brand the Ulta brand um, I've never tried anything from the Ulta brand and I really want to do a full face first impressions using all Ulta makeup so I didn't get everything I need to do the full face I'll pick up you know things here and there over the next couple weeks and um, then do it but I just picked up the three first things I would need so I got the Ulta Fabulous Face Foundation Primer also got the Ulta Demi Matte Foundation, which does have a pump, so I am really excited about that. Packaging is really similar to the um, It Cosmetics Your Skin But Better CC Plus Cream. That's a mouthful, but like a pump and squeezy bottle like that. I love packaging like this for foundation. And then the last thing I got was the um, Ulta Full Coverage Concealer. This one is in the shade Light Warm, so I'm definitely excited to try that out. And last but not least, I got the Physicians Formula Butter Blush. So, so excited to have this. And it was the last one on the display. I don't know why, but it's such a good feeling when you get the last one of something you wanted. There was two shades, and the other one is really, really, really light. Both of these are pretty light. If you have deeper skin tone, you're not going to have good luck with these, unfortunately, as all Physicians Formula products. But this one I got was in the shade Plum Rose, and it's just the most beautiful like natural you can't even see it swatched on the skin though this is going to be so beautiful I can already tell I love colors like this for blushes I don't really like like really pinky blushes or you know really pigmented blushes so I can already tell I'm going to love this and of course it smells like a tropical vacation which is always a plus. Okay guys, I felt like I went through that really fast, but that's okay. I wanted to get through it fast so my camera doesn't die. I'm going to get through the outro really quick. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos and check out that giveaway video down below so you can have a chance to win some amazing prizes. And I think that's all I have to say, so I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.